Nigeria's three-month cash crisis could end this week as banks have compiled the latest directives from the Central Bank of Nigeria. Financial analysts hold different opinions about the potential impact of cash crisis on banks' financial performance in the first quarter of the year. However, it is believed that electronic banking income is set to hit records high following the widespread shift to electronic payments, which resulted from the Naira redesign policy. Banks' income lines remain unaffected as the crisis did not impact interest income and commission income, which are the major revenue streams for banks. Nigerians have experienced difficulties accessing cash due to the Naira redesign policy. However, the central bank has relaxed its cash withdrawal policy, increasing limits for individuals and corporates. The Apex Bank has directed banks to collect all their cash requirements from the CBN to serve all customer demands while opening their branches on weekends. As a result of these measures, the crowds at bank reduced and most ATMs are now active. However, Bank officials still anticipate much pressure this week, but expressed confidence that the situation would improve and probably be resolved completely by the weekend. David Adorn, Vice Chairman, ICAP Securities, believes that the slowdown in economic activities resulting from the cash crisis, which impacted bank operations, will have a negative effect on the financial performance of the first quarter of the year. He noted that the challenges with mobile payments during the period, which resulted in a deluge of failed online transactions. The value of electronic payment transactions fell by 4% month over month to 40.6 trillion naira in February from 42.4 trillion naira at the end of January. Despite the surge in electronic payment transactions, which led to increasing in the volume of e-payment transactions month over month by 29% to 1.5 trillion naira in February 2023 from 1.2 trillion naira at the end of January 2023. The massive shifts to electronic payments resulting from the Naira redesign policy is set to boost banks' electronic banking income. The volume and value of electronic payment transactions rose by 63.3% and 33.4% respectively in the first two months of the year. This trend is in line with projections by Kauri Asset Management Limited, which said that most Nigerians will adopt the use of electronic payment channels for business and personal transactions, which may further lead to a decline in presence in the banking halls. According to the FBN Kids Capital Limited, this development would translate to a significant boost in electronic banking income, which represents 6.9% of the earnings of the five Tier 1 banks in the nine months to September 2023. The five banks, First Bank, United Bank of Africa, Guaranteed Trust Bank, Access Bank and Zenith Bank, recorded income of 188.57 billion naira from electronic payment services in nine months to September 2023, while total revenue stood at 2.71 trillion naira during the same period. The head of equity research, FBN Quest Capital Limited, to the ABA, believes that commercial banks' electronic banking income for banks should be robust in the first quarter due to the surge in electronic transfer following the cash scarcity. We also believe that banks are generating income from the free floats that they are currently enjoying from customers' inability to access cash.